You might say, well, well Scott, um, I've screwed up. I've made bad decisions. I've... How many have made a bad decision? Let's, let's normalize the playing field right now, okay? How many have made more than one bad decision? Raise the other hand. Okay. All right. Now that we got that out of the way, every single one of us have made bad decisions. Okay, so let's normalize the playing field. There's nobody in here who's perfect and so holy that you don't deserve the right to sit next to them, okay? But listen, do you know that your skin cells are replacing themselves every two to three weeks? In fact, every two to three weeks, you get an entirely new set of skin. If God can create your body with 70 to 80 trillion cells to reproduce skin on a two to three week basis, do you think that that same God would not give you a clean slate every morning? Do you think, for some of you who looked at pornography last night, some of you who made bad decisions this week, some of you who, who acted out on some of those things that you were thinking, God is a God of grace. God is a God of mercy. And Jesus said, what, Jesus, what do we do? What are the works that God requires? Jesus said, believe in the one he has sent. Friends, the road to hell is paved with good intentions. The road to failure, likewise, is paved with good intentions. Finally, in your notes, the road to insignificance is paved with good intentions. But the road to significance is paved with good action. 